Hello YouTube and welcome back. Uh, sorry about the last two videos, they've been cutting off halfway through. Um, well, at least I found another phone, so I've got to use a phone, to um, make me my seek e-juice review. Um, so basically I'm just going to finish off from where I left off with the rainbow sherbet flavour. Um, Sorry about this, what's going on. Sorry about everything that's went on. I should retake some more videos like that, but when I get a better phone. Um, but anyway, don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment underneath. Um, like I said in the last video, yeah, I'll be making more liquids eventually. And I'll be selling them and giving them away. But anyway, let's finish up this one. And uh, then after that, I'll maybe do a little bit of talking at the end about the e-cig and stuff like that, you know, to, make, to compensate for all the messing up that it's done. Anyway, this one is Rainbow Share, but it's loaded in the e-cig now. As you see, I've got it on charge now, but I can still use it when it's on charge. That's the best thing about Snow Wolf. Um, it's only a 90 watt Snow Wolf Mini, but it still works. It's decent enough. Yeah, with this I've got to leave it on for a little, for a little bit before I even take a fit from it so you can see a little bit better. Anyway, let's try this flavour. Well, the flavour is really nice. I really enjoy this flavour. Um, it's a good all day vape. Um, because it's not too sweet, it's not too sickly, and it doesn't get to your throat as much. As it is only a 3mg anyway, but you can get these in 0, 3 and 6 in the UK. Um, yeah, um, it's high VGPG, obviously. Um, yeah. Uh, let's finish up with this. I'll explain the taste and flavour, stuff like that. Well, it does taste like, you know them rainbow sweets you get them, like in a tube. I don't know if you can get them in the US or anywhere else, but in the UK they're in like a long tube, and it's got pink, red, or the colours of the rainbow, anyway, in the tube. Um, the flavour, it's perfect for all day vaping. But, yeah, anyway, let's just talk a bit more about the snow wolf I've got. And stuff like that since that was the final flavour. Um well I'll get them all out and we'll do which flavour is the best out of them all before I do anything else. Right. The mutant vape had no taste whatsoever. It was just boring, no taste whatsoever. So that's obviously not a winner. The Fusa Green Slush had a strong taste, but a harsh throat hit, so I'm going to put that in 4th place. Um, this one, that had a lot of flavour, it's very nice, um, I think I rated this one a 5 to be fair, uh, so that's obviously going to be at the top of the list. Um, this one, I didn't rate this one just yet. I'm just waiting. Um, I'm going to rate this a fab, so that's a winner too. And the Rising Up, that's a winner as well. Three of those three flavours are now winners. Um, I advise you to buy them and try them out, just and then let me know if you if you like them too. Um, in the UK, they don't sell 30ml bottles no more. They're all going down to 10ml. Um, but yeah. So there are your three winners there, straight up, three winners. The thing is, I don't know if any of you have had this tank before, but it's the Temple Tank. And um, there it's got Alien Jewel Coils because it's custom built on the inside. Well, I, I didn't build this one, I bought this one already built. Um, it's produced a 
good amount of vape when it's actually working. Um, well, when it's charged, it, well, it does work because it does work. And yeah, I got this for fifteen pound, but I don't know about. I think the original price was about seventy quid for them in the UK. I don't know if any of you had this, have any of you lot have this e cig or this tank. Um, if you can, if you if you can, you can let me know what sort of build you use and um, what mods you have. If that's what you want to do in the comments section and. If you leave a comment, I will reply. Um, but I might not reply as soon as because I'm a very busy person sometimes. But I will try to reply as much as I can to all your comments. And um, I'd really appreciate if you could subscribe and like and share this with it, with your friends or whatever on Facebook or anything else. And um, yeah, well, thanks for watching anyway. Um, I hope to come back soon with another video. If you leave some at the bottom, like some ideas, I could try and do them. Um, but apart from all that, um, I shall see you again in another video. And let's hope we don't have any technical difficulties like this one has done. Um, and I apologise for it all cutting off at some of the parts. Um, I just didn't know that the phones were like very low. And then um, the camera quality might not be that good because I'm using an uh, old Microsoft phone because it's all that I've got to make to get thingy on it to get um, for a storage. Anyway, thank you for watching. Um, I hope you like the video and I hope you all come back soon. Yeah, it's dead. It's very low. Starting to keep up a little bit more.